ESPN and the NFL Network are reportedly nearing a deal that would save NFL Network amid a worrying period for the latter, with NFL media having undertaken mass layoffs over the last several months. Major changes are afoot where the network is concerned, with former star wide receiver Michael Irvin let go this week, while it's been reported that NFL Total Access is being cancelled after a run spanning over two decades. The Athletics Andrew Marchand reported that the league was in advanced talks with the worldwide leader in sports in January, while he was still with the New York Post. The two parties were said to have been discussing an agreement that would hand the NFL an equity stake in ESPN while the Disney-owned company would take control of NFL media. According to Pro Football Talk's Mike Florio, an industry insider reckons the agreement is all but signed. That would help explain the NFL's recent slash-and-burn approach to NFL Network. If ESPN is going to be taking over, why should the NFL renew contracts? Florio writes. Also read, breaking, NFL Network cancels one of its most popular daily shows in shocking move that will disappoint everyone. The NFL still has several important NFL media staffers under contract. One of the biggest is Ian Rappaport, who recently renewed his deal with the league and could now become colleagues with Arch rival Adam Schefter, though the contractual situation is now unclear. The NFL has been restructuring its programming this offseason, with Good Morning Football going on break. The show is also set to shift from New York to Los Angeles. There's also the aforementioned cancellation of Total Access. Florio notes that the deal between the two entities could occur as early as next week. Should it go through, it would mean that ESPN reporters would probably be unable to offer unbiased opinions on league affairs, which could make things very interesting.